what is up. So today I'm going to teach you how to do this and also another thing called the bridge. And look at that little donut right there. That's my belly button. So yeah, just remember that this requires a lot of arm strength and arm strength. Alright guys, so to get so started, I always want to stretch. I'm using my foot, by the way. So this is Olivia. Yeah, my, um, I, my, it's too big sister. I'm fine. Yeah. So, you wanna, so you want to stretch. And fart. Yeah. <laughs> you want to stretch. And um, remember just to stretch your whole leg out. And touch your toes and bring them back as far as you can. Or touch as far as you can. So it's okay if you can't touch your toes all the way. Make sure your knee is completely straight. My knee is oh, yeah. Is my knee completely yeah. And so also, next you want to do your neck, you want to straighten out your next foot. And then to kind of get started, you want to um, stretch out your thighs. Kind of if you can, and like this, just to get everything nice and ready for what you're about to do. And also, since you're relying on your arms a lot, you want to stretch them out good. If you can stretch them any other way, that's perfect. Okay, so now let's get started All right, on guys. what we're so about to do. To get started in this starting position, you want to uh, um, you want to get a good distance distance away okay. from the wall. Just get back a little bit. You want to get a good distance away from the wall, but not too far away. Yeah. And um, yes, it's perfect. And so you want to have a good space in between your hands also. And so to get started, you want to put one foot up on the wall, just a little bit higher, and then you want to take. Once you feel ready, you want to take your other foot and put it up. And then to and then for the finishing, you want to keep your you want to put both of your feet and climb up the wall as high as high as you can. And for beginners, it is a lot easier to have someone hold, hold you up so that you don't have to do so much of the ab workout and the arm workout. So you can go ahead and step down, Olivia. And now I'm going to demonstrate. Okay, so I'm going to demonstrate to you guys how I do this. I'm going to have my hands placed a good, a good amount of length away, and also my hands to the door. So, I'm going to take my foot and put it up here, right in the middle. And then I'm going to take my other foot, and well, the taller you are, the bigger the steps you can take, obviously, right? So, um, you want to put your foot as high up as you can go with just one foot, and then take your second foot and go even higher. You should be able to go higher on the second time, and then you are in the final position. <laughs> Alright guys, so if you can't do that on the first try, don't be worried, because it took me about six years to completely master it that well. But I bet you guys can do it better if you practice at least once a day. Alright so, guys, so to let's move on, on to the next, next one. one. You are going to um, take your, you're actually going to bend your knees, start down in this position, and then bend your knees like this. And then... Put your arms here, scoot this way a little bit more. Um, put make your arms straight like this, and then bring using your abs, bring your bring your butt and your torso up. And you can also walk to give this exercise an extra fling. Alright. So now on to the bridge. So we want to start out with in the same position as the crab walk and also arch your knees. Then you want to put your hands like this. Just like this, and then just like the crab walk, this is a little, but this is a little bit harder. You want to bring your abs and your butt up. You want to bring your butt, and then use your arms to push your abs up. This may be a little hard at first, but then once you get the hang of it, it's pretty easy. So it's, I cannot walk like that, but a lot of people can. So don't expect to get it on the first try. It took me a couple tries to get it right. So yeah. all right, guys, that's pretty much all for this video. I know that I said in the last part let's get on with this video but we're not actually getting on with anything we're just ending the video so if you guys would like to see more please like and subscribe and give my sister a good round of applause because she did a she did help a lot mm. and so if you'd like to see more please like and subscribe i already said this but if you guys have any ideas for future videos please let us know and we'll see you guys later bye, bye.